Our biggest goal in the group is is always to get into the, the PSAC playoffs. But the second most important thing is that our group is always looking towards the future to, to improve upon our game. Once you get to a point where you're winning games a lot, and then you sit there and you say, well, how can we win the games in a better fashion? How can we have more possession of the ball? How can we create more scoring opportunities? How can we make the game look uh, a little bit sexier to the eye to watch? Things like that. Findlay was a is a very good team, and they're going to do quite well in their conference. Um, so for us, it was it was a it was a great result. Um, sometimes you focus more on the result though than you focus on the pathway to getting that result. Um, and Saturday was one of those moments where it didn't really matter the pathway that much to us. It mattered getting the first W up on the board for the 22 season. And you know, you're, you're kind of competing apples to oranges with some of the restrictions that we have here as a state university and, and limitations with roster sizes and all sorts of things like that. Um, and, and the budgets are significantly different. So it's always, anytime we can pull a result on one of those guys, it doesn't matter if it's Gannon Mercier's or Seton Hill or a Walsh or a Findlay or any of those types of schools. It's always a big scalp for us because you know you're you're kind of you're you're punching above your weight class is what it comes down to. In this game, though, it doesn't necessarily mean that you can't get the result out of the game. You do things the right way. You have the right mentality. You're organized. You have the grit, the, the grit and the work ethic. Then you can you can overcome a lot of those obstacles. We kind of go with that standard that make ourselves hard to beat, stay organized, stay healthy, make sure we're not giving anything away cheaply, and then we let the games play out.